Well, I guess I can't help myself. It's getting cold out and it hasn't snowed much. Today we had our first snow though. On my way to work and I missed it all. I should have had you going on here this day. Anyway, what I'm doing is a mess of stuff here. You wonder what that is? My old art teacher, Mr. Dart Gowan, as he liked to know me, gave me this old raccoon kiln he built out of a bucket. See? And a burner going in there and had a top on it. And something like that. And uh, I bought this blanket from Tim Fredericks and uh, almost got enough here. But, you know, I remember now we got to keep the pieces up. I did a little trim in there. See? Now we still got a little fiddling to do. I'm not going to leave this on for too long. What I'm going to do though is get it covered up so I don't have to store that blanket in the kiln. And then over here, see? Got a little hole there you can look in. See the pots in there? See how red it's getting? Anyway, here's your imagination. Uh, got a hole there. Got a hole in there. Well, this will fiddle with the focus, won't it? I should have a tripod, that would, uh, anyway, so I get sidetracked, as you can see, there we go, look in there, now there's an easier one to see, it's got more light. Alright. When I'm looking in them holes, I really like to be back here, sort of, well, that's close enough. That's far enough, I mean. That's <laughs> close enough. That's close enough. I'm going to bring some stuff around here. So, do I need to cut this? Well, what I want to do is uh, study this. Cut you loose because uh, we can't have you running out this cold too much. I just couldn't help myself. And we got a nifty setup here, of course. Well, that's too dark to see. Let's, let's do that later with the knife and the cutting the wood. See, now we got her covered up a little bit there. It's starting to take shape for the winter. Got a, got a dew and a coffee and a, and a uh, ooh, wow, what do we got here? <laughs> later. Well, we've been up a couple extra hours tonight, but look what I just finally accomplished something here. I got it all covered in, and we used a bunch of dart stuff right here up on this upper corner here. Just about ran out and found all that stuff in the bottom of that bucket. And about all we got left is a little pile over there. It was part of the bottom and the top, I guess. A few scraps of the new stuff. So now, I think all I gotta do, first of all, is get down here safely. <laughs> Oops, I almost fell. <laughs> wow, this looks so cool, eh? Now, Cover that with some insulating fire brick or hard brick, either one. 
I think I'm gonna start putting up right on this stack here. All we gotta do is build her up with no lag even for a minute. Break this in, get some heat to it. She started cleaning out here. So, I might want to get some uh, Call it uh, morning. Let's see what happens here. Well, anyway, all righty, folks, that's just about the idea that I was trying to tell you about here, see? We got that, uh, top of the kiln sort of covered with, uh, insulating fire brick, sort of covered. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Do some with that plastic, bring it around, and uh, try to build some chimney on this, I think. And then get a little fire going in there, get some charcoal. See, down here. Like I said earlier, and I cleaned it out a little. pile of charcoal in there. <laughs> if I ever get to bed, eh? Time to get some rest gear. Kind of neat, eh? 